Hello and welcome back everyone to Human Resource Machine. We are going to take a look at Year 17, the exclusive lounge. So what we are supposed to do is for each two things in the inbox, send zero to the outbox if they have the same sign, i.e. they are both positive or both negative, or send a one to the outbox if their signs are different. And repeat until inbox is empty. I mean, that's just the usual. Again, we have two versions of this, so you guess why. Um, so what we do is we take from the inbox, if it's already a negative, or if it's a negative, we jump down here and check if the second one is um, also a negative. Uh, the, the thing with all these jumps here is that um, normally I try to do the output at the end, but we had to save on commands in order to meet the size challenge, so bear with me if that is a little bit complicated. Um, unfortunately, I can't even fit it on one screen. So, you take from the inbox. If it's a negative, you jump down here. Um, check the second thing in the inbox. If that is also a negative, you copy from 4, which is the 0. So both have the same sign, both negative. Copy from 4, 0, put it to the outbox. Um, if the first one is not a negative, you go to the inbox again and check again if it's negative. If it's negative, they have the they have the different signs. You have a positive and a negative. In that case, you copy from five, which is a one, put that to the outbox. If it's negative, uh, if it's not negative, you go to the inbox and then it's again not negative, you copy from four, and then you jump down here to the outbox, and uh, outbox a, five so a one I'm um, sorry uh, actually let's just let's just have a look at it so essentially inbox inbox and each time you basically you branch out here take the inbox you branch out um, if it's negative you do a second check if that check is also negative you copy from four because so four is the zero for the same sign if uh, the check says not negative you branch out again if that thing is then negative copy from one if it's not negative copy from four and uh, essentially you just have to make sure if you want to meet the size challenge that you only have one outbox command and that you only have one of each copy command and then you have to manage your jumps correctly so we use 12 commands in this case if you want to copy it, you probably have to jump a little bit in this video. Again, I unfortunately can't fit it on one screen. So let's just have a look. We take from the inbox. It is a negative. So we jump down here. Take from the inbox again. This is also negative. So we copy from 4, which is the 0 for the same sign. And then we jump right to the up box. We go to the inbox again. Again, it's a negative, so we jump down here. We take from the inbox. In this case, it's not a negative, so we jump right up there to copy from the five, which is the one, which is uh, the uh, different sign. And then we outbox it. And then again, five, it's a positive. 8 is a positive, so we copy from 4 for same sign, and outbox to the 0, and so on. So you don't actually, the important thing is you don't actually have to store anything anywhere. So you have 12 commands, unfortunately too too many commands, uh, too too many steps. So again, I have a second version for the um, for the uh, speed challenge uh, this one is really complicated um, I mean again it's the same thing just saving one jump command which is the one after the outbox and um, because that is what creates the loop and I end up with this so inbox jump if negative inbox again check again if it's negative and then make the decision if it's a 0 or a 1. Well, actually, it's the other way around, a 1 or a 0. And then eventually outbox. 
and um, in this case I actually have two outbox commands um, as you can see I also have 15 lines versus the 12 before so you can have more lines um, if the checks help you eliminate um, eliminate um, actually using those commands so inbox jump if negative inbox jump if negative and then we've got the copy from copy from and then essentially we have another block down here which has two copy from commands and outbox commands so if you want to copy that um, I'm just going to scroll over that a little bit more slowly so you can pause the video again it does the same thing and then I just copied it I think four times yeah so each of these separates the individual um, blocks of code so with an input of eight you have the same result so in this case we use 60 commands versus our 12 from before but now we hit the 28 steps and that's the exclusive lounge see you next time